Here's where we'll find a scientist working with sand, which is another kind of rock. Hi, Joseph. Hi. Whoa! What the heck? I'm making sand designs. Oh, really? Now, how are you doing that? Well, well, you see I put a little bit of sand into this? Yes, I see. Then, then I put a little powdered paint to make it colorful. How much sand do you put in? Um, about a cup. Ah, and then you put the powdered paint in. Oh, well, what colors are you going to use? I'm going to start with orange. And why did you pick orange? I just did. Oh, wow, you really mix it up good. But how long do you mix it? Oh, I see. The longer you mix it, the darker the color gets. Ah, oh, say, that's a terrific-looking orange. Yep, then I'll put in blue. I'm putting in a lot of blue. Now, why are you doing that? Because I want it real dark. So, when you have your colors all mixed, then what do you do? You take a jar, and you could make a just a layer of any color as much as you want. Oh, I see how it works. Here, you put one layer of colored sand right on top of the other. Looks almost like stripes. <laughs> what do you do after you make all these layers of colored sand? Well, when you're done with all the layers, then, then you could always take a, a straw and then you push it in as far as you like. Now that looks beautiful, just like a painting. Hey, here, let me try that. Hey, hold that glass jar toward me. Okay. No, I just push the straw down in the sand like this. Is, is that right? Mm-hmm. See how it came out? Mm, looks really neat. Do uh, you have any more you can show me? Yeah. This and this. Ah, uh -huh. I see you can even plant a cactus in it. <laughs> it's amazing what you can do with rocks. I might make one myself sometime. Uh, great work, Joseph. Thanks. See you later. Bye. Bye.